Hey, 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 it's Natasha with Birthmarks Renewed, and I decided, let me straighten this out a little bit, I decided to go ahead and do a review, and I'm calling it Black Up Tuesday. No blackout for me. I'm not going to be silenced. I have a lot to say all the time. As many of my friends and followers know, I always have something to say. It may not be great or articulate, but I try and get it out as best I can. So anyway, today I decided to do a review of the products that I have bought over the past uh, three months or so, maybe even longer, maybe within the past six months or so. Um, but I decided to share a few of my favorites and also give my reviews on how they are. And if you guys like them, like the quality, want to try them out, um, I'll go ahead and shout out everybody's email addresses or website so you guys can click on that and get to them, okay? So the first one that I am going to uh, review is going to be um, Brown Sugar Box. Really like Brown Sugar Box. Started using them about two years ago and I really like all the products that they have in there. They're all women made. They all have great um, little trinkets in them. I have an air pillow that for the airplane. Um, I got some makeup. I got a fanny pack. Um, I got some candles. I got some matches. I got some really cool stuff. Some earrings, some watches, things like that. And one of the shirts that I got was this one. And it says, and I think it's so fitting for today, it says, let me get up here. It says, relax, relate, release. And this is so fitting in this time, right, guys? Relax, relate, release, right? And it is uh, a mental thing. I put it on to make myself feel good. I've gained a few pounds, you know, since I actually got the shirt. But if you put in your size and what you actually like, then they will tailor it to your needs and they will send you things that fit you. If it doesn't work, you can always send them back. So Brown Sugar Box is really good. Really, really like them. Um, and this is just one of the few items. I have another shirt that says uh, Catch Flights Not Feelings and uh, Black Girl Travels. It's very uh, black women oriented and I love that because black women do love to travel and that's just part of our inner nature and our soul. And so that was really good for me and I've been supporting them for about two years. Um, and you can cancel your subscription at any time and then restart it back up. Sometimes you may have to go on the wait list because they, you know, they get full. So they're a really good one. Another one that I really, really like is, um, it's my favorite <laughs> and I have quite a few products. So Juvia's Place. I love Juvia's Place. I've started ordering their products not too long ago, actually, probably about two months ago maybe three months ago, um, I start really buying things because my cousin Majar is a super makeup guru and um, Beauty by Jay, we'll talk about her in a little bit. Um, she really likes their products as well. So I decided to start trying it a little more. My first palette was amazing, love them. Um, and uh, it was called The Masquerade. This is my concealer that I have, if you guys can see that. It's called Juvia's Place and the color is called Oh my goodness, I'm blind, you guys. I think it's Sahara. I think it's Sahara for that. But anyway, the number on the bottom, if you can see it, is number 12. And they're really good. I like it. It matches my skin pretty well. My skin tends to break out. This is my um, my wet zone or my oily zone, I like to call it. And then I have oil pockets here. Sometimes I'm a little dry here. So I tend to break out a lot, especially down, you know, during certain times. So I really like that. This is um, the concealer. I also have, I have a ton of their stuff, guys. So I just want to let you guys know. It might be a little bit. So let me get situated here. So <laughs> this is my first time doing a YouTube, but we're going to get through this together, okay? So um, this is their eyebrow concealer or eyebrow fill-in. You can also use this as an eyeliner. People say it says eyeliner. I like to use it as an eyebrow filler because I am not good at eyeliner at all. And it has a really nice consistency. I use this probably about four times and I just dabbed it with this really cool little brush that came with it. And this is to spread it out and this is to kind of fill it in. It's angled, it's nice, it's lightweight and it comes um, with this and it also has another um, color which is more like I guess for people's eyeliner it's pretty black I haven't used it yet um, I'll open it up so you guys can see it if I can grab the little lip there it is it's super black um, I think this would be for more when I have somebody do my makeup for me or I have a lot of time to do that because I am NOT a guru maybe I'll try somebody's YouTube video I really like that stuff and I'm just gonna show you guys a few of the palettes that I have which are amazing so I have this one, 
which is called the Warrior 3. Amazing colors, bright, vivid, so nice, right? Opened it and I was just in love, okay? So uh, you guys probably gonna see me with a lot of crazy colors going on because I don't really know how to apply them yet, but practice makes perfect. Then I also had the Nubian 3 and Coral, and this one is amazing as well. Look at all the vivid colors. So pretty, lots of blushes, um, lots of iridescent colors in there with a little bit of vibrancy and some nudes. Those ones are good too. And the Warrior 2, so I got all of them, okay? This one's really good. I got this one because I saw somebody wearing it with the black and the white and a little bit of the um, blush shade in there. Really nice. Once again, Warrior 2 by Juvia's Place. Got the Nubian by Juvia's Place. Super cool, super nice. Look at that blue. That's one of my favorites. That is so vivid and so blue. Reminds me of when my mom used to go out back in the day and kind of just jazz up her eyes. And she was such a blue and like... Um, like a light gray color and she really liked those so I got that because it made me think of my mom and um, this one is called just the Nubian this one's pretty good too I like it and uh, I tried a couple of them and I mixed it my cousin did my makeup one day um, if you guys follow me you'll see the pictures on there and she did a really good job <laughs> it's my cousin Majara who is a makeup guru and this one oh this is called the warrior this made me fall in love the colors are so me and something i can wear every single day if i wanted to they're nice and subtle but they also give that pop and that shine and the vibrancy of her colors is just phenomenal love them this is called the sahara or saharan excuse me um by juvia's place i've used this one as you can see just a little bit and i also love this purple at the top and the purple at the bottom if i choose to wear purple this is what i would use is one of those this was my very first palette by juvia's place and it's been used quite a bit by me it doesn't look like it because i'm not that great but i've used it it's called the masquerade this one is really good as well and she's actually reasonably priced love her products love everything she has and this is my last one this is the saharan 2 these are pretty new and she had a sale going on a couple of weeks ago so that's another reason why i have all these palettes because i can afford them right now um so i bought those so that is juvia's place i also have her foundation and i i just really love it it's really good it's good for my skin doesn't break me out um i do have to be very very cautious of how i mix it because this one i got from my cousin and it's a little lighter but it's also a highlighter for certain parts of your face i'm not great at it so i have to be cautious of how i use it i don't want to look like i'm super like you know white um so yeah that's my juvia's place really love her and next I'm going to move on to some of my hair products and some of my facial products that I use that are black owned as well.